Now, he got so much press in that Bay Area that there was a, uh, like it was like a news show. Now, this is what you're going to see in, in Tom versus Time. This is one of the first times that he's interviewed, and he still has that same demeanor. Like, you got to hand it to it. There's some good parenting somewhere, Dave, because if I'm a coach, I love kids like this. I love the, I mean, this is all American apple pie, aw shucks kind of stuff, and, and, and it's real. Like, this is, he is not an act. He is authentic, which is what I like. And the, interesting in the news story, this guy that, that, that goes on to it, because I'm not going to show this part because there's a bunch of stuff in between this that's not very good. But he goes, well, maybe these are one of the names uh, down the road in the future that you might be hearing, like uh, possibly at a Tom Brady. <laughs> well, pal, ah, you're you, wrong. you should have put some money on that one. Here is one of his first interviews he does with the Bay Area uh, news uh, television station, his first piece. And has he really changed that much? Once again, here's Tom Barry. Well, over across the bay at San Mateo Serra High School is a six foot four, 200 pound quarterback named Tom Brady. Ready? After an MVP performance at Cal's football camp this summer, Cal High Magazine ranked Brady among the top six quarterbacks in the state. Okay, I'm a college coach. I haven't seen any tape of you. I don't know anything about you. Tell me about Tom Brady, the quarterback. What are your strengths? My strengths? So well, everybody tells me I have a pretty strong arm, which is which is good. I'm pretty accurate with it. And uh, I think I need to work on my speed a little bit, but hopefully that'll come in time. Pretty good work ethic, so, so I think I get the job done. His coach says Tom has what it takes. The exceptional athlete, and usually one that's the world-class athlete that makes it, is the person that has the willingness to make the commitment uh, to be able to go that extra mile. My game is strong. I got All right, that that's where we're out of here. Okay, fine. Ooh. You uh, had me until you played that song. Yeah. I was ready to bring yeah. them to my college. And then they'll goon us because uh, it's owned by DJ Slappy. And, Ooh, DJ Slappy. Yeah, who knows? Don't worry. Russell has a pretty good relationship with DJ Slappy. Just become best friends. Yep. <laughs>